By the end of the day, the biggest headache and the biggest challenge in the industry is the fact that there are tons of different systems, uh, various generations, and often we may find retailers with um, really point of sale or network environment that may be even 10 and 15 years old. Uh, there are thousands of different point of sales out there. There are thousands of different, uh, um, different providers. And I think that if we can help the retailers simplify it uh, by having a common platform on one hand, and on the other hand, uh, help them make educated decisions by having an RFP ready kind of a platform uh, and uh, allow them to deploy that in a more economical way, faster, uh, we will be able to help them really excel in their overall business and, and become better operators. And Edgex is really trying to provide that platform that uh, dissolves that fragmentation. So you have many cloud providers, you have many connectors. Edgex is now starting to be that, um, if not standard, that um, at least that, that platform to which everybody can go to to help bridge the gap between your devices, your cloud, whatever they might be. I think to that extent, we're very, very successful. Um, if we're not a standard, we're coming pretty darn close to. As we look across the ecosystem, one of the things we hear from retailers is that it is incredibly challenging, especially at the scale of our members, to try to implement different technologies in ways that are gonna be, that are gonna work, that are gonna be cost effective, um, and that are gonna enable them to have um, flexibility in what they do, particularly in store. And that's really what we see the, the capability here that's being built is the ability to have that interoperability across different um, devices, different manufacturers, um, so that you're able to actually deploy um, a number of different technologies, a number of different, different IoT solutions at scale. And that's really ultimately what Real is interested in is helping all retailers to actually deploy technologies to benefit their businesses. If you think of like the grocery business, they work on such a small margin. Um, so just about any grocery stores you've ever been to, it's usually one to 3%. So if you can save them just a little bit um, of that you know, tenth of a percent to half a percent, it's real money to them. Retail is, is a you know, market that's, that's really getting kind of hammered by the online. What we see in the industry is a connection between the two, that the confluence of both online and offline and melding those experiences together to serve consumers is really what retail, the modern retail, uh, experience is all about. And that is really predicated on being connected with technology and utilizing technology, whether uh, it's social media or whether it's IoT devices in store, all, using every tool at your disposal to be able to serve your customer and communicate with your customer in a new way. And I think that ability to communicate across all of these platforms and across all these technologies is really what's defining modern retail. And so Open Retail Initiative, uh, Intel led the launch of, and us and a number of other companies uh, are participating in. Uh, linked to EdgeX is kind of like the code base that, that's, that's driving it. So, you know, we picked retail because of the Open Retail Initiative and just it's, it's an industry that's kind of ripe for transformation. And, and the goal is to help people leverage open source technologies to be able to build you know, solutions so they can become, become more competitive, you know, stay, stay, stay ahead of the game. I think that retailers are really exploring, different retailers are trying all kinds of different things. And I think in terms of attracting the top talent that's out there, I think they're willing to try new things. And maybe in the past, maybe they wouldn't have been because they could just build another store and that was sufficient to be really good at retailing. I think what we recognize is in the 21st century, that's not sufficient. You've got to meet customers where they are. And that means being able to utilize a wide swath of technology to really enable your business. And the only way you can enable, use that wide swath of technology is if you have the best talent and you're bringing those folks in and you're willing to be creative. And whether it's being a part of hackathons, whether it's you know, bringing in different technologies, whether it's using open source, which really in retail is not common. Um, in many cases, lots of the foundational technologies in retail were, were these closed systems. That's a new thing and that's part of why we are so excited to be a part of um, the EdgeX uh, work today is because we think open source is such an important part of the future of technology and will be a, an important part of retail moving forward.